Hi people, this is Inyo from PRDB Entertainment. We're, welcome to our third tutorial. Tonight I'm going to show you guys how to work with a simple character. How to create a simple character, at least for the shapes. And for the next tutorial, for the fourth tutorial, I'll be teaching you guys how to add the bones so you can start making your animations. Um, right now, I have told you guys, I have teach you guys how to work with the keys how to enter into the edit mode and all those kinds of stuff so I'm not gonna be explaining a lot about the keys now first of all edit mode so from here like I showed you guys on the on the last tutorial from here we're going to be working with uh, the meshes we're going to extrude the mesh so we can have we can expand parts of the mesh so we can make more things with the object now I'm gonna choose these four points like, like I showed you guys extrude we'll left click control and pull up and keep doing the same at least for the times that you want to work Uh, what we are doing here are the legs yep that's what we are doing we're doing two legs here now let's make the body damn it come on really you gotta be doing that Let's make the head. There you go. Now let's make the arms. My bad. Let's press the wrong key. I'm trying to go like really quick with this. There we go. Now let's do the other one. So right here we have two arms, body, head, and two legs. Let's scale this using the S and the uh, the S and the X for the red one. I'm gonna choose part of the body here. S X. There we go just trying to make something simple okay let's try to work this one out again SX SX there we go A deselection and choose this part here S ah, my bad. SX SX. Now oh, let me choose a part on the inside. Okay, what's wrong, man? Why the hell are you doing that? Don't start. Don't start. There we go. SX. Mm hmm. Looking nice, huh? Let's pull this one inside because they are too big. Make a smaller SX. We still gotta pull the other ones inside too. SX. There we go. We can still pull from here. SX. There we go. Now we gotta pull this part up because it's way low. And from here we're gonna be using S, Z for zebra. There 
press X so we can close a little bit. There we go. And now let's work with the feet. Press X. There we go. Nice, huh? Okay. Really cool, huh? Now, let's select everything. Let me pull this up a little bit. So I'm going to try to make a little bit of, of the feet here. There we go. So we got extrude here also. There we go. Well, let's work with the other one. Pull down. Just making something simple, nothing fancy. Extrude. Ugh. My god, come on. I'll do this really quick here. There we go. So we have the feet, we have the legs, and still I'm gonna pull them a little bit inside. They are way too far yet. There we go. Uh, let's pull this one here inside. Oh, I haven't. Oh, okay. I'll take the other ones too. So. Why the hell is it taking that? Okay, let me leave this part. I just messed up something there. I'm going to pull this one up. Now for the arms. Now the easiest way to select your points is pressing the B key on your keyboard. I want to do it right now. So I'm going to choose these four points and I'm going to choose these four points. So there we go. Now, let me extrude from here. So let me choose these points. What is this? This is going to be like a simple hand. Nothing big really. Exactly the same thing for here. There we go, and we still got the head. So the head, we gotta pull it a little bit in. There we go. There we go. A for the selection. Now let me pull this down. I don't want to really play with something that big. Now let's extrude here.
can't see here. There we go. Just making something easy, nothing really big. So there we go, we have a simple head. Oh, I'm going to pull this one inside a little bit. Uh, same thing as, as later. I messed up this part here, so for that I need to, to combine the meshes here. I'm not going to be trying that right now. Okay, as you can see, we have a simple character here. You don't have to make it this nice. Just try to make at least the legs, the the arms and the head in any shape if you want to leave it like square it doesn't really matter I just wanted to make something simple here but uh, try to have everything the heads the body the arms and the legs because uh, we will need to add bones to that parts so the mesh can move around with the bones also now this is the only thing for a third tutorial only character basic character creation uh, for the fourth tutorial like I told you guys I'll be teaching you guys how to work with the bones for the animations this is Angel from PRDB Entertainment see you next time